Hello everyone and welcome to Just a Tip. Today I'm going to be showing the absolute easiest way of actually changing your Photoshop language from whatever language you have to English in just under a couple of seconds. So before I even start, I sh should actually point out that my computer is not in English, it's in Portuguese, but I'm going to be guiding you through the old way of the process, so don't worry about it and just tag along. So as you can see, my, my Photoshop is not in English at the moment, it's in Portuguese and I'm going to be changing that very very quickly. So I'm going to be going to my computer, I'm going to be going to my hard drive, program files, Adobe, Adobe Photoshop, then I'm going to go to my locales folder. In here I'll find a folder with my language initials and I'm going to double click on that, support files, and then in here I'm going to find a, the TW10428 file. Now what you need to do is basically deactivate this file in order to make your Photoshop revert back to English because you see Photoshop's default language whatever the case is going to be in English it's just going to be translated because of your Creative Cloud preset that you had prior to your download. So to deactivate this file just need to change its extension so I'm going to just put an underscore right after that and I'm going to save the extension like this. Now the file is deactivated, I'm going to exit out of the folder, go into, into my Photoshop, and as you can see, it's already translated on this loading screen. And it's going to be opening up, and everything is translated. Now, I'm just going to wait a little bit while this loads, before I just tell you one more thing before I end the video. As, as you can see, it was very, very fast, just a couple of seconds to do this, no sweat, but uh, yeah, everything is changed besides this panel over here. Now this panel, I think it's connected to my Creative Cloud, so that's the reason why it's still in Portuguese, but it's not really that big of a deal, everything is in English right now, I can work properly with it uh, like I wanted to, and I guess that did the trick for me, hopefully it did the trick for you guys. If it did, please leave a like, share it, Comment down below what you thought of the video, if you like the format, if you like the concept of the, of the channel. And if you do, please subscribe and hopefully stick around and I'll see you in the next video.